Hi everyone, Kristen Roberts with United Way of East Central Iowa. Last year, through our community impact assessment, we found the number one challenge all of our communities face is affordable housing. And in our last Connecting Communities, we talked quite a bit about affordable housing. And yes, our communities definitely need more structures, more affordable housing units. But what also we need to do is we need to create economic mobility by creating pathways for individuals and families. Economic mobility is kind of a bit of an official term and not everybody knows what it means. So really what it means is that individuals are provided the skills, the tools, and the opportunities to become economically stable. Here are some examples as to what the disparities are where we live. In Lynn County alone, an African American household on average makes $30,000 less than a white household and a Latinx household on average makes about $15,000 less than a white household in Lynn County. And what our research is showing us is that a simple budget isn't going to change this. Instead, there are complex systematic access and educational barriers for these individuals and families. We need to start investing in employment pathways for, for individuals as young as high school. And we also need to create pathways for those who are un or underemployed so they can earn a livable wage. Another example to think about, you want to buy a home, but yet no one in your family has ever bought a home before. How do we make sure that our friends and neighbors know that this is a viable option for them? How do we get them the education around what the home buying process is? These are the types of things that United Way is starting to look at, particularly thanks to our community impact assessment. Along the way, we also know that we are going to have to ensure that our families and neighbors have a safety net along beside them of services so they can continue to grow in that economic stability. So when you support United Way, these are the things that you are supporting. You are supporting our friends and neighbors and helping them make strides towards that economic stability and supporting them as they get there. So thank you so much. We are eternally grateful for your support and we hope you know what a difference you're making in our community. Thank you again and stay well.